A big donation, a $10 million donation, has been made to Jacksonville's Museum of Science and History. This is leaders are working to raise money for relocation of the museum to the north bank of the St. Johns River. Atia Collins is on your side speaking with museum leaders about the timeline for the move, and she also has an update on other downtown projects. Lot X may be empty now, but with this $10 million investment, MOSH leaders are one step closer to moving the museum here to the north bank. We are making a landmark donation of $10 million to the Museum of Science and History. MOSH leaders have a $40 million fundraising goal for the museum relocation. They expect to reach that goal by June. Most of the delay is lined up with, with negotiating the formal gift agreements, but we have soft commitments that would get us most of the way there. So uh, to those who say that we, we can't do it, I would just say, watch us. It's not the only development in downtown Jacksonville making progress. The city just accepted a record-breaking $147 million federal grant for design and construction of the Emerald Trail's remaining five segments. Construction is currently underway on the new Riverfront Plaza and Shipyards West is going through the design phase. According to the mayor, the city is inching closer to a deal for construction of the new Jaguar Stadium. We are closing in, yes we are, on a negotiated stadium deal with the Jaguars, which we hope to announce in the not too distant future. All of the projects, Mayor Deegan says, will give the city an economic boost and help make downtown Jacksonville a destination for residents and tourists. We're putting the pieces together for game-changing events in our city. Now, MOSH leaders say they are still on track to begin construction here by December of next year, and they are hoping that the museum will be open to visitors in 2027. Reporting in Jacksonville, Tia Collins, First Coast News, on your side.